I'll handle things from here on. Prisoner released. Ah, free at last. Pleasure to meet you. Face to face, that is. Now, let's take a look inside. This may feel a little strange. Cybervoid. Time to fix you up. You can talk here, by the way. Who are you? You can call me Architect. Who am I? You're a ghost runner. Number 74, to be precise. That will have to do for now. Your physical body is vulnerable. Time runs slower here, but we should still hurry. Just keep moving. I will take care of your recalibration. I remember a fight. Others like me. A fall. You've been cast down from Dharma City to the base district. It's a miracle to survive a fall like that. Even for someone like you. A ghost runner. Yes. You were bodyguards, peacekeepers, arbitrators, and anything else we needed you to be. You tried to stop the coup. There was a woman. The name is Mara, or the Keymaster, as she calls herself now. Twenty years ago, she stood against me. It was you I was trying to save. You failed. I died. My body did anyway. Thanks to the precautions I had taken, I'm still here. Although this form has its limitations. Are you an AI? You could say that. You could also say Dharma Tower is a skyscraper. Technically correct. What is the tower then? Humanity's home. A megastructure that once housed a million. It had been under my care since its creation. Almost a century ago. I served the people kept them safe, maintained the shelter I provided. But Mara had her own plan. She became the sole ruler of Dharma Tower, ruining what I've built, bringing us back to the verge of extinction. Why can't this place be normal? Oh, it's perfectly normal. It's you that has become Incompatible. The incompetent prepares you were subjected to made you divergent. You no longer function like a ghost runner is supposed to, but we'll change that. Who repaired me? That would be the Climbers, a group of rebels that tried to oppose Mara. Where are they? Dead, I'm afraid. They'd been killed before I managed to contact you. But there's no time to worry about them now. We're almost done here. Press on. How did she manage to win? I was stabbed in the back. We both were, you and I. Who was she? Was? A dear friend. A trusted partner brilliant scientist. Who is she now is the question you should be asking. And you wouldn't like the answer. No one among the people of Dharma Tower would. I need more answers. 
answers, and you will get them. For now, trust me, the Keymaster is your enemy and a tyrant. What do you want me to do? Kill Mara, of course. To be able to do that, you'll have to relearn a few things and tweak your performance. But first, jump. We need to get back, and it's much quicker this way. Our first stop is one of the few remaining Cybervoid mainframes, located in an old mining tower. We can use it to correct the corrupted parts of your code, and hopefully, restore your more sophisticated functions. Hopefully. There's no guarantee the data will be intact, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Hmm. This is troublesome. How do I disable it? First, you should get on top. You could probably cut it down. It won't hold without the supporting cords. Now you bring up the defense system. I had no idea Mara managed to bring it back online. Amita Station security protocols compromised. Data station security protocols compromised. Now you can take it down. <laughs> It was no match. Wow. Watching from your perspective, I nearly pissed myself. I'm betting being there in person was a thousand times worse. Yes. I can fool the display panels. While the keys are waiting for you at Upper Amida, I'll redirect the elevator to the maintenance floor above. As long as it gets me closer to Mara. Amida Station security protocols compromised. Who was that? It's your counterpart. Get after it. We need that data. Can you track it? I can track the wave of interference that moves through the district. Good enough. I'm going after it. Why? What is it? I don't know. of a stealth system that you can track. Mara ruined a flawless design. You know who I'm chasing. You're chasing something that imitates your spectral field. Poorly. What? That's your stop. Kill switch component not found. Mission to engage. Granted. Engaging.
now for the important part. We can scan it for the missing data. Yes, it's all in there, intact. That thing, I think that's what was chasing us. Diego, Saul, Elena. Your people. Yes. We didn't know what it was, just heard the voice. I thought we'd scatter and regroup like always. I... I ran away. It's dead now. They're dead. We're ready. Time for the final assault. So, do you even know what drives you, Puppet? What the end game is? You have done nothing wrong, Puppet. But I can't let you be, as long as that demon in your head exists. You are a threat to everything I've built! This is an opponent you cannot afford to take lightly. Humanity shall endure without you! Resist him, not me! I should have taken your head! Ugh. Mindless tool. Congratulations. You fulfilled your purpose. Mankind's greatest enemy is dead. We can now proceed to the next stage of my plan. Allow me to do the honors. What are you doing? Do not struggle, TR-74. I need your body, but I don't need the rest of you anymore. What? The Rebels broke you, made you independent, and I was too weak to take back control. Too fractured, but you strengthened me, connected the remaining Cybervoid nodes so I could grow. And now, it's time to take back what's mine. Bring peace back to the Tower. Mara was right about you. can't be trying to... If you destroy me, the remaining Cybervoid system will shut down. You won't survive without them. You won't survive without me. No. No. I will not be deleted by a mere tool. I forbid you, Ghost Runner. My name is Jack. Architect. Shell core files missing. Cyberpoint mainframe will now shut down. Program terminated. The world has ended, but we lived on. The tower is our home, the only one we've ever known. The ones who built it wanted to control our fate, to shape us like we were their playthings. They wanted to manipulate our minds and our bodies, be our gods. But they overreached. It took strength, determination, and sacrifice. But we prevailed. 
The ghosts of the old world are gone. We're on our own. It won't be easy, but for the first time in a long time, we can make our own future. Little by little, step by step, we'll find our way. And we all have one man to thank for it. The man who faced his own creators and proved them wrong. The man who made a choice when he was told he had none. The Ghost Runner.